Four or five weeks ago, just about everybody assumed that on this day, the Old Dominion football coaches would be busy looking ahead to next year and the players would be preparing for Christmas vacation. Everybody but new head coach Ricky Ronnie. I'm Bruce Rader. The Old Dominion football team heads down to South Carolina next week for its first bowl game since beating Eastern Michigan in the Bahamas Bowl five years ago. Their opponents in the Myrtle Beach Bowl next Monday are the Golden Hurricane from Tulsa. Coach Ronnie is fired up and Craig Loper has that story. Thursday, our first time meeting with ODU head coach Ricky Ronnie. Since it was announced, the Monarchs will be headed to the Myrtle Beach Bowl, the second bowl game in program history. Now, since that regular season finale against Charlotte, Ricky's been a busy guy in various states on the road recruiting. But he said today there was a moment where he did stop to take it all in and absorb what a bowl berth means to the program. I probably looked at it and, and felt the accomplishment for maybe a day felt the joy certainly in that locker room and everything after the game and then uh, you don't really get time to soak it up and you're just thinking about hey how can we make this thing better and how can we keep improving outside of the game itself Ronnie saying today he hopes his team and his coaching staff take away the important off the field stuff that comes along with a bowl game as well. There might be a memory that happens in this uh, 10 to 15 days that you know um, in, in 20 years from now you're sitting around and uh, that's the story you tell. So I hope that that's what happens. And obviously, um, it's always a lot more fun when you're able to tell that story with a win uh, as the culmination of the story. In terms of making the trip to South Carolina, Ronnie said him and his wife have already purchased about 20 tickets and plan to purchase probably some more too for those friends and family making the trip to the game in support of the first year head coach. We're going to have more on this game throughout the weekend and heading into next week before the team departs for Myrtle Beach next Thursday. Reporting in Norfolk, I'm Craig Loper for the Sports Wrap.